Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlemagne's adventure in Star Maid. Oh, looks like that's another sh sh shop way up there. Okay. And oh, look at that. It looks like a pirate base down there. Some planets. Looks like some asteroids way out there. So what the heck is going on with this game, hey? It looks like Minecraft, but it's it is nothing near Minecraft. <laughs> uh, this game is a voxel-based 3D sandbox space shooter, and it's a very neat game that you know I, I don't know that I got a long time ago, and I'm glad I got it. Uh, I got it back in the summertime, and I've just been waiting until I, I felt like playing it. Um, I've got some ideas before this game, and so yeah. So basically, I'm just going to play it through. I was going to do the tutorial first, but uh, I don't know. Instead of the tutorial, I'm just going to just start playing, and we'll we'll figure it out as we go. Okay, so there's these things called an undetonator. I'm going to activate it so that way my spawn point is set to here. This is where I want to arrive. Is this place because it's a store. So we're going to stay away from that pirate base down there because I'm not sure how close you could get to it before it starts to attack. And obviously we don't have a spaceship to you deal with that. So I figure that we can just start building a ship together here right on screen and yeah. Um, I'm going to explain a little bit more of the game and then we'll get started. So in this game you can create, discover, destroy, customize and design your own worlds, your ships, space stations, whatever. Everything is completely open and you can create whatever you want in this game world. Uh, on top of that there's your orbits that these planets do slowly. They all, they all orbit around kind of like a, a star in the system, like that star up I think. And then there's other stars like that one way over there. Then there's one over there, one over there, one over there. So you can kind of see them in the map here. And you can harvest materials for manufacturing and that's what we're going to do together. Uh, I'm going to go over there and attack those asteroids I think. Let's see if there's anything else around here I can see in the distance. No, okay, so those are probably your best bet, those ones straight that way. So we're going to build a ship here, so let's do that. I think it's X to build a ship? Ah, oh, yes it is, okay. What shall we call this? So I was playing this game in a higher resolution, but I'm playing it in a lower resolution, and then I'm extending it into the bigger resolution, so that way my FPS stays up there. So, we're going to call this ship. Let's go... Charlene War. Oops, only one L. Charlene Wars. First. If I are at first ship. Okay. Okay. So there's goes the core, and I think it takes the core out of your 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 inventory here. Uh, my helmet here. I think I'm not wearing a helmet right now. Let's take a look at this right. Shift. Um, no, how about left shift? Ah, there we go. And now I'm putting my helmet on. There we go. See? There we go. Uh, shift. Ah, come on. This is stupid. The system. There we go. Hello. Hello there. Can I do a wave? How do I wave? Oh, well. <laughs> Anyways, let's get on to playing this game. Let's go back into. Uh, First person mode. Uh, zero. Left click. Okay, I'm not sure how this is working, that stupid thing. Ah, screw the helmet. Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness, peoples. Okay, so, anyways, I'm going to enter the ship core. And we're going to be in build mode. So build mode, you can fly all the way around. And where you see the arrow is the front of the ship. So this is the front of the ship. And this is the back of the ship. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start placing these blocks here. 
So we want to protect our ship core. So let's place them here. I think I left click. Yeah, I think I left click. Okay. So let's protect our core. I'm not sure how exactly, but let's take that away. Okay. Let's go up here. Okay. And then let's go. Let's put let's put a little platform here. So that way when we're standing on it, we can get into it. Let's let's just uh Let's see, too high, hey? Ah, okay, let's redo all this. Okay, I don't know if I want all these blocks like this. So let's just build it as basic as we can and we'll go from there. So basically what we need is we need to power our ship. So I think we use these power... I think that's it. Uh, a power reactor module. Okay. Now there's a certain way that you build these. So I'm going to build it it backwards from the ship core because I'm not sure how the ship handles itself and well um, I don't know if I want to do that let's do it right from the back here actually so now the amount of power that this would generate if you look on the left there you'll see 476 E per second well that increases as you add more to this and then what happens is say you increase your your zone size, you'll notice that the power increases as well. Let's see. Let's uh, go down here. Let's... So I'm at 1279 power per second, right? Uh, oh, see, that doesn't go up as much as I needed to. That goes up more like that. Hmm. Okay, I'm out of power modules. Okay. So I'm going to put a salvage beam in here, six. Yeah, I think I'm going to put them all the way back because the one salvage beam will... Actually, let's, pl let's place the controller because you need a controller. So like the salvage computer, you need that to control kind of, you know, your salvage beams and whatever other material that we may need. So let's actually rotate this. How do we rotate this? Um, hold shift to move faster. Shift mouse wheel to zoom. Press left control. Uh, okay, that's just symmetry plane and stuff like that. Okay, no, but I want to change the positioning of this. How do I turn this around? I'm going to have to look that up. So I'm going to just place that there for now. So I want to see this screen over where my control panel is here, or the, the control core is. But anyways, so now if you notice, this is selected. So now I'm going to place salvage beams. And I'm going to place them, I think, like this. One, two, three, four. Okay. Maybe one more in the middle. So that the way there's three of them. Oh wait, those are cannons. I don't want cannons. Ah, uh, uh, six, here we go. I was wondering why I had so many. So one, two, three, four. Okay, let's, let's, buy, uh, let's buy another salvage computer. So let's see here. Or not a salvage computer, but another salvage camera thruster um, support tools. Here, salvage module. Uh, since there's a lot in stock, we can buy one. Shop has infinite supply. <laughs> I don't want that. I'm going to have to fix that in the settings. So, yeah, so I'm probably most likely going to delete this world. I don't know. Uh, but basically what I'm doing is I'm just building the, the ship here to go harvesting with. I'm not going to put weapons on it, I don't think. And I think I got everything I need on it. So to get out of build mode, you press the space. And now we're in flight mode. So now... Oh yeah, there's no thrust. Okay, let's go space. We're going to add thrusters onto this. Cannon barrel thruster modules. Uh, where can we put these? 
Let's do it just like this. I don't think these matter where you place them, but for what it is, I'm just going to put them in here anyways. Okay, good. So we got that. Uh, do we have anything else that we need to put in here? No, looks like we don't. Still got 20,000 credits though. I thought I... I bought something for 54 what the hell unless it's picking me up as the administrator but that's weird spy huh well but I'm making money but it's not deducting Huh. Okay, well, I'm going to have to look at the settings of this server because I bought a game server for StarMaid and it's not working or behaving as I expect it to. So anyways, let's get to our, sh our ship here and we're going to try and do some, some uh, salvaging. So let's see here. Whoa. What did I hit? Hit the ring. Okay. The physics is kind of weird in the game here let's see how do you rotate no that's up down okay and we're flying towards here you press the shift to stop okay this is actually a very tiny asteroid why is there like nothing here this is stupid so now I'm just using my beam um, why is there only the one coming out of it. There should be three beams coming out of it. What the fuck? The left mode, uh, I'm focused with right mode. Work with all weapons. Yeah, but... Weird. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on here. But basically, you mine this stuff to... Tr uh, here we go. This is what we're looking for. Those gems. Hmm. <laughs> gonna have to regenerate this world so I don't want to play too much into it oh yeah look look they go flying oh what's going on here that's cool bye bye so yeah and uh, this is a pirate sh base here let's just see what happens if pirates spawn in or not let's take a look here uh, do I see pirates coming in no. Looks like it's all torn up though, this base. That's interesting. Huh. Did someone already come here and blow this up? Or what's going on here? That's weird. A worn and decayed. Huh. What's this one down here? Very interesting. Looks like I'm, I'm going to have to regenerate this world because I don't like how or what was built looks like everything's dilapidated and and dead which is kind of weird let's fly this way here see what this is well that's kind of a weird looking base hey is that like a big spaceship or something or huh what the heck is this stuff, man? Look at this stuff, man. Let's take a look at this stuff. Let's get out of this. Is it space bar? Yeah, it's space bar to get out. Okay. Let's, let's give this a little... Oop. Whoa. Um, R to get out? Oh, here we go. It's so weird, this place. Look how big this place is, man. What's that B button? Oh, okay. Tank 11 Kamikaze? Is this like a public server, this one? Or is this not my server? I think I might have put the wrong IP in, maybe. Hmm. Very interesting. Let's check this out, though, anyways. Let's see here. 
get close to it and see what happens. See if we can harvest it. If we can, then we know it's ours. If not, then we know it's it's. Let's see here. Worn and decayed. So this is very interesting, huh? Maybe it's blown up. Maybe it's like a derelict thing. Well, that's kind of neat. You can kind of see how everything was built. You can turn these lights on and off. This is uh, lift is busy. Yeah, lift is broken. That's what it is. Hmm. What's this module? Oh, yeah, I'm just picking up scrap stuff actually. That's so weird. There we go. Plex doors. Decorations. Huh. Very interesting stuff, man. But I'm going to have to check this out because I don't know if this is mine or if this is uh, somewhere else. Where's my ship? Oh, here it is. Way over here. So, yeah, I don't know. So, basically, you know, this is Star Made. We can fly around, we can uh, shoot stuff. If I built actual cannons on my ship, uh, there's things to shoot, which I haven't really seen. If we go, uh, let's see, was it P for map? Here we can kind of look at where we are. So this is a, supposed to be a pirate station. Both of these are supposed to be pirate stations, but yet, where are the pirates, right? You think they'd be flying out of this thing attacking you? Hmm. Very interesting. Well, I'm going to play with my server settings, but this is kind of the game I've been thinking about. Ho hopefully you've enjoyed this episode. It's kind of a brief you know, mention about Star Maid and, and the fact that I do want to play this game because it is pretty neat. Uh, I love the Minecraft style games and I love the games that allow you just to do whatever. Now, my frame rate sh should be okay, but it seems to be really crappy for some reason. I don't know why, but hmm. let's see where we're going to go. Let's go P for map. Path to turn and min warp. See, I can just warp myself, so it, it's picking me up as an admin. Mm. Oh, hey, this is shooting at me. This is shooting at me. That's so cool. I'm gonna die. That's okay, though. We're gonna restart the world, though. That's bad aim, though. I, I bet you I'm invulnerable. Bet you. Let's see here. Zoom out of the ship. Let's see here. Let's fly it forward. Uh, left shift, is it? Uh, fuck, I don't know. I don't even know how to left control. Oh, that's, oh, that's how you rotate. Okay. It's very terrible, though. Left shift. Okay, that's how you rotate. But see, it's, they're not damaging me. That's stupid. Well, I'm definitely, I'm definitely going to have to play with the settings, but looks like some stuff is working. Uh, but it's laggy as crap, though. Fuck. So where's the ship's FX punch damage, eh? Oh, no, wait. I am getting hit. Never mind. Hmm. But where's the, the pirates that can come and attack? It should be sh your ships that can come get you. So let's check this one out up here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just kind of exploring here just to see what's going on. So let's do that. Let's admin warp here and see what's going on. 
Where are we? Well, something shooting. Oh yes. But let's just fly right into it. Who cares? Looks like there's turrets on there. <laughs> Woo! That's scary. T there we go. I'm dead. So that's Star Made for you. Hmm. I'm going to have to restart the server here. I'm going to have to regenerate it because there's some things not working with it. I don't see any pirate ships flying at us and I don't see see anything I don't know. And I don't see like an NPC like in those sh those uh, shops you should see an NPC but yeah well hopefully you had a good time with me here and in Star Made and I look forward to seeing you in the, in the next episode. But as far as, as first impressions go, this game seems pretty amazing. You know, definitely amazing, and I'm glad that I got it way back before it was on Steam. And, and yeah, you know, you all have a great day, and I'll see you in the, in the next episode. Bye-bye.